Hello everyone. In this video, we will discuss about what most important topic in entry also many time they will ask. So how to pass value from flow to LWC. Okay. We know the importance of the flows because most of the people and most of the companies are using flow only. Okay, because for flow and process builder, they're going to duplicate in the 2023 release. So the flow is very much important. And now we can see how to pass value from flow to LWC. Okay. For that, we need to create the two steps. First, we need to create the LWC component with the input parameter. And um, so we need to create one screen flow. So we need to pass that LWC component into screen flow. Then if we can able to pass the value, what are the values we are giving in the screen flow, we can pass it to LWC. Okay. So let's see uh, how it's uh, how we can able to do that. Before going to the topic, if anyone need any job support, you can send me your message to this WhatsApp number. Okay. So now we can go to the uh, topic. Now I'm going to create one lightning web command I'm going to create. So control shift P create lightning web component. So a uh, component, we can give anything. LWC to flow similarly, we can a common we can give anything. And location is a default one. So now you can see the common has been created now. Okay, so we can, what we can do, we can import, we can create one um, field basically. Uh, at API, okay, input value. Similarly, I'm giving. This is my input parameter. Uh, so what I need to do, I need to go to, we need to go to metadata file. Here we should give true, okay. After that, targets. Target configs. In this target config, we need to give target config. In the targets, lightning, sorry. Not this one, just a minute. We need to give, we need to give the targets only we need to give. Targets, inside the target, we need to give the target. Target, okay, here what we need to, we need to choose the lighting screen flow we, we should choose. Okay, targets, inside the target, we need to give the target. In the target, we can give uh, lighting screen flow. So after that, what we need to do, we need to target config. Okay, inside that we need to give target config and we need to use this target config into here. Okay, so after that, uh, we need to give the property basically. Property and name, mm, I will give the, we need to give this name input value. Okay, and type here we need to string array of strings. So multiple values we, we can give and label if you want we can give no issues okay i'm giving search text so coming from screen flow just save it this one okay so we got a list of values we got now we need to iterate here we need to do so for example in the div i'm giving inside the div what i'm going to do uh, i'm going to template if true okay so not template if i trade actually i treat no, I cannot write it. So where it is, yeah, template for each actually. This is a class, I'm giving this one and template for each. Okay, so in the for each, we can give this input values. Okay, whatever the values coming, it will be displayed here. Um, here, what we can give, I am from LWC component. Okay, just save it now. You can see div. This is a class name. P. I am from LWC component. Template for each input value. 
this is the iterate value i am iterating each one by one by value and i am using here see wait just save it now we have done everything in the flows uh, lwc common side so what we can do we can deploy into our or so this is my or i'm going to deploy to source or yeah the common is deployed into our com uh, or now i need to go to uh, setup and flow setup flow so let's click on this flows I'm going to click on new flow. Choose screen flow, great. Now you can see the screen flow is created now. We need to choose first we need to assign the values. So now I will be assigned. I need to choose the assignment. The assignment we can give string value something. I'm giving string value. Uh, variable I will create like variables AP name uh, the staff uh, the staff array of string we can give it okay array of string and type text hello multiple text okay hello multiple text and click on that okay now we can see this is the variable in this variable we need to add because this is the we have choose the list of string so and we have choose the multiple values in allo, so allo so that's why we need to use allo now i will give first first okay same val variable add second same va variable add third third same variable i'm adding fourth okay so four values i'm assigned now click on done so variable is assignment is done now we need to do the screen flow in the screen what we need to do we need to call our flow uh, lwc common we need to call uh, here first we will set the flow label flow to lwc i am giving the name so a name we can give anything no issues okay after that here we have one yeah which way lwc to flow this is the lwc common we have created in this lwc component this lwc common we have created because lightning flows screen we, if you give this target it will be show in the LWC comment. Okay. Now I will do drag and drop here. Okay. Now, so what I will do give the values, the value array of string coming from flow screen. Okay. This is the label. You can see what we have done coming from flow. So this is a variable we have given. So that's why the variable display here, and then we have passed the list of array of string values so we have created four values the four values we have set into this one so it will be go go to here in this variable in this variable will be iterate one by one by one and it will display okay now i will give some name to flow or some not to say lwc something you click on done i think it's everything is done now flow label we can edit right flow label yeah. yeah flow label okay fine no issues flow to lwc mm, yeah save it now on the flow i'm giving like connect Connection between flow to LWC. Just save it now and 
we could we can debug this one let's see how the value is displaying here or not and we can see i am from l c component okay we are this values display in the screen you can see in the i am from l c component the values whatever we are given in the flow it will be we got this value and it will be printing one by one by one here so now what we can do i can go there just activate it okay so go to home page uh, edit page here we have one option flow right just drag and drop here mm, here what is our flow name connection between flow to lwc see now we can go back now we can see this is a flow name actually this is a by these values printing from the flow lwc component i am from lwc component and the first second third fourth value we have given in the flow variables we have given we have set these values here okay so if you want you can add anything if this one we, we what we can do we can get it from the screen itself we can pass this the dynamic also we can do it so now i have showed you how to pass the value from flow to lwc's component okay this is the method to pass the value from flow to lwc component okay so uh, if you have any doubts or any uh, other related questions you can put it in the um, comments i will be replied okay so yeah thanks thanks for watching